this is a thing. Apparently, this is the only thing I'm known for on the internet now. Because... Uh, yep. There it is. I'm uh, covering my address because, you know, the internet. But, uh, yeah. That's the letter. I guess I should start from the beginning. So, um... I guess it started in my English class. Um, we were doing a unit on writing formal business letters, and the teacher decided to have us write business letters to businesses or celebrities, people we admire, companies we admire, people like that. For one of my letters, I decided to write to Jeff Kaplan. The letter I wrote to him goes as follows. Dear Mr. Kaplan, my little brother and I play Overwatch on almost a daily basis. We love the game and we really bond over it. It really has brought the two of us closer together and I thank you and everyone at Blizzard for that. However, I am left with a few questions related to the storyline. My main question is about Symmetra. She's my favorite character hands down and I remember in her comic she's mentioned to be on the spectrum. I assume this is referring to the autism spectrum, which wouldn't surprise me considering Satya's behavior, but a lot of people say the line is referring to a spectrum of light since she works with hard light technology. I just wanted to clarify, is Symmetra autistic? As an autistic person myself, I'd love to know. I know you didn't write the comic, but you are the main director of the game and I'd like to know your input on the situation. Thank you for your consideration, Samuel Hookham. That was my letter to him. Did I expect to hear back? Not really. I just kind of hoped. And apparently the, that hope got me somewhere. Because... This. This. <laughs> Feels so stupid, like, putting my hand like that, but I have to so I don't get stalked. I... Got, I heard back from Jeff. And, uh, the first thing I saw in here was this, which is probably the best thing ever. It's little cute spray magnets with the little main logo magnet in the middle and they come apart and you can put them on stuff. I'm probably going to, I have no clue where I'm going to put them, but I'm going to put them somewhere. And then of course, the letter. This is it. Amazing. So, Dear Samuel, I am so glad to hear Overwatch is providing a great way for you and your brother to bond. Nothing warms our hearts more than hearing stories like yours. I'm glad you asked about Symmetra. It was very astute of you to notice that she mentioned the spectrum in our comic. Symmetra is autistic. She is, a most she is one of our most beloved heroes, and we think she does a great job of representing just how awesome someone with autism can be. So thank you so much for taking the time to write to me. I really enjoyed your letter and will share it with the rest of, you of the team. Wishing you and your brother many fun games of Overwatch. All the best, Jeffrey Kaplan, Game Director Overwatch. And yes, he signed it. So anyone who's doubting that this letter is real, just look at the fact that it's signed in pen by Jeff. I mean, what do you want? <laughs> what do you want from me? That is probably the most exciting thing that has happened to me in a long time, because I was not expecting to hear back from Jeff, or at least not soon, or as soon as I heard back. So I heard back in like a month. Like, apparently not a lot of people must write to him because this was this didn't take very long to get to me now since i posted this letter on tumblr with my address censored of course it caught a lot of people's attention because uh despite the symmetra autism theory being really big for a long time it had never been officially straight up full-on straightforward confirmed until now. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize this would have such a big impact on the community. Multiple people have already made videos on the, my letter. My letter. 
I'm just a 16-year-old kid from fucking the valley. I mean, yeah, I live in California, but I'm nobody. I'm just, like you said, some 16-year-old kid. I go to a school for mentally ill special ed kids. But I got this. I heard back from the director of one of my favorite video games. I love Overwatch and I look up to Jeff and I never thought that I would ever get something like this from him. Something where he is speaking to me directly and it's him speaking. I mean, that's amazing. That's, that is amazing. I, I can't even... Wow. And this letter has had a huge impact on the community now that it's been confirmed that Symmetra has autism. I've seen, I've seen so many people putting this letter in their videos when they're talking about Symmetra getting confirmed to be autistic. I mean... Holy shit. And those videos have so many views. So many, especially compared to my Tumblr post, which just has like, what, eight, nine hundred notes? And these have like, hundred thousand views or more. That's insane. Honestly, just, it's amazing. I can't believe that something I made, and something I thought was just gonna be an English assignment, led to all of this. I mean, I'm not fucking famous or anything. I mean, it's not like people know my name when they're looking at the letter. They just, they all they see is Samuel and occasionally get linked back to the post that I made. But I mean, no one really knows who I am personally, but I don't really care. I don't care if they know who I am. I don't care if they know that me personally was the person who made the letter. I mean, just the fact that I, that I being, I, by writing a letter, had such a huge impact. That's just amazing to me. Honestly. My sister and my brother keep teasing me saying that I'm famous now. And then um, my, sister, my sister, who refers to Jeff as Mr. Overwatch, has been saying uh, that I'm best friends with Mr. Overwatch, which I think is kind of funny because my family is just full of comedians. And the fact that people are taking this so well, I mean, I mean, a lot of people aren't. A lot of people are getting mad. A lot of people say it's like horrible and just like, f like I saw this one article. It was like first Tracer gay, now Symmetra is autistic. Like, really? And then I saw this other. I only looked at the um, the the video title because my friend told me not to watch it because he knew it would just make me mad. It was saying like, you can't have like a gay person and an autistic person and a gender neutral robot all in the same game, it's not realistic. Like, dude, I'm gay and autistic. I'm friends with a gender fluid person. I'm friends with a another trans gay autistic person, because I'm also trans. A, a, a lot of my friends have autism and a lot of my friends are gay. And I have know quite a few people who are either trans or gender neutral or gender fluid or whatever. The game is based on characters from around the world. Ha having one person in these however many heroes from around the world be gay, and another one be autistic, and one be- for that's a fucking robot for crying out loud, fucking not have a gender, cause come on guys, Bastion, it's, it's a robot, why is it such a big deal? Zenyatta is a boy, Orisa is a girl, Bastion doesn't have a gender. What's the big fucking deal? See? Does, does that look like someone with a gender to you? Yeah. I mean, and I'm, I've actually, um, I think the main reason people aren't, like, linking back, a lot of people aren't linking back to me or saying my URL when they talk about my letter is because they don't want to, um, they don't want to throw me under the bus, basically. Because a lot of people are getting mad about this. Despite the huge amount of positive support, there are negative people. But if you look at any of the videos, you will see 
that the amount of likes is always bigger than the amount of dislikes. Way bigger. And I mean... That's just... Um, I'm To know that people like me are supported that much is amazing. I mean, I mained Symmetra way before I read her comic. Which my friend says is cancer because she's way overpowered, but that's beside the point. Because I mained her before she got buffed, bitch. I, I honestly don't even know how to feel. I mean, there have been articles written about a letter. A letter that, that I've just, I've held in my hands. That I pulled out of an envelope addressed to me. It has my name on it. That's my name. It's just, it's causing so much and affecting so many people. And so many people, and I've seen so many other kids who play Overwatch with, not even kids, adults too, Ki kids, all adults, whoever, who play Overwatch, who have autism, who have seen my letter and seen the letter Jeff wrote to me. To me, of all people, to me saying that, yes, Symmetra does have autism. And it wasn't a huge announcement, it wasn't a big deal. He was just answering a question I sent him. For one thing, Jeff Kaplan, thank you. Thank you so much for writing back to me. Thank you for answering my question. Thank you for reading my letter. Thank you for sharing my letter with the rest of the team. Just thank you for everything. I really, really appreciate it. It's just, you know, so many people reject kids with autism or use autistic as one of those half-assed insults, but I told him I have it and he didn't care. He was just said, he, he just said that he was glad me and my brother are bonding and that if Overwatch was bringing us together and, oh my god, I'm actually, I'm actually starting to cry. And he said that, and he was just, he treated me like a normal person, and he just wrote back. And not only did he say that, he said he thinks Symmetra does a great job of representing just how awesome someone with autism can be. He didn't just, like, treat me like a normal person. He literally said that kids with autism, or adults, or anyone with autism can be awesome. That's amazing. That's really amazing. Honestly, though, thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Blizzard. Thank you, everyone who has liked the videos, or reblogged or liked my post, or read the articles, or made videos about this letter. Everyone who's helped the word get out about Symmetra. Thank you. Thank you. I just, I don't know what else to say other than thank you. I'm really, really, I'm not only glad that Jeff confirmed it, I'm just so grateful that people are so supportive of people having autism, that they're, they're spreading this around. That's just so amazing to me. Sorry for the shitty lighting, by the way. It's just I'm in front of a window. Sorry. It's what it's what we got.